Hello, my Oracle deck lovers. I have a new deck for you. It's called Universal Dragon Oracle. It's by Carla Moro. Here's the guidebook. Comes with a copy of the picture there, the header, and a description. Okay. Dragons. There are very few creatures as powerful as majestic or as widespread as dragons. They are calling to us sometimes as a roar and sometimes as a whisper. All of us have heard that call, that something in the distance that makes the air on the back of our neck stand on end and stirs within a deep and ancient knowledge that is at the very heart of this deck to help translate what the dragons are telling us. Will you hear the call? This is by Blue Angel Publishing. All right. It kind of repeats here on the back of the deck. We have all heard that something in the distance. The dragons are calling, sometimes as a roar and sometimes as a whisper, to stir deep and ancient inner knowledge. There are very few creatures as powerful, as majestic, or as wise. Dragons are reaching out to us, trying to communicate, and this gorgeous oracle is here to help you receive and interpret their guidance. Award-winning oracle creator Carla Moro worked with 11 dragon families to create an actionable deck that you can turn to for purpose, direction, and sure steps forward. Dragons are harbingers of creativity, inspiration, and positivity. They can lead and inspire us through complex decisions to simple solutions. Timeless manifestations of seen and unseen worlds, fascinating, magnificent, bound to our oldest imagination and most daring visions. Here be dragons. Will you hear their call? All right, and here are the cards. Isn't that pretty? The first card is acceptance. Gorgeous. Oh, and there's the back. Action. Awakening. Balance. Bliss. Boundaries. Change perspective. These cards are really thick. Um, they're hard to kind of turn, but they're probably really great to shuffle. So there's your change perspective. Community. Oh, look at all the butterflies. How cute. Uh, conviction. What a mess. My gosh, you guys. I'm so sorry. Creation. Determination. Discipline. Right? Emergence. Family. Flow, fortitude, oh my gosh, goals, oh my goodness, I am so sorry these cards are hard to turn, grounding, growth, guidance, Hibernation, imagination, <laughs> oh gosh, like seriously, just mind you, you can always fast forward the parts that you don't want to even witness. Independence. You would have never known that that card wanted to be seen. Inspiration. Knowledge. Leadership. 
Listen to self. Love. Meditation. Open your mind. Patience. Peace. Play, protect your ideas, purpose, research, rest, seek knowledge, service, stillness, Speak your dreams. Structure. Truth. Wisdom. Shall we? Fortitude and purpose. Family acceptance. Fortitude and purpose. Maybe there's something happening with your family that you're just in denial about. You don't want to accept it. And in accepting it, you'll find that strength, that foundation, and um, <sighs> purpose of it all. Because you cannot fix it or work through it if you don't accept it first. Or perhaps there is some sort of situation that you just need to come to terms with regarding your family. Perhaps there's something going on in the family that's going to actually strengthen your bond with one another. And that's the purpose of it even happening. That's the purpose of your family. Perhaps you thought that the purpose of family is to be or find acceptance. To have that strength and support behind you in order to find your purpose. But there are plenty of people who can find family outside of family. Your family doesn't have to be blood. You can find a community that will give you that same um, support, that same foundation, and they will accept you because of your purpose, because they understand how all of that works. They understand what love is, and they understand what family means. I'm not certain. Please share your ideas below. Take care and thanks for being here.